This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. Listen, U.S. consumers had filed a lawsuit against the Trump administration, Exxon, Chevron, Russia, and Saudi Arabia. In this lawsuit, they claim that these groups conspired together to shut down oil production to raise the price of gas at the pumps. And you know what happened today? The courts in San Francisco threw the case out. They said that they were trying to, lit to litigate political questions. And they said they were trying to litigate the oil producing policies of foreign countries. I'm going to tell you guys something. It seems that it's very difficult for the 99% to win, even in a court of law. We have to fight tooth and nail to try to get some type of justice when these one percenters, these big dogs, these countries conspire together to steal money from us. And in the lawsuit, they're alleging that Russia, Saudi Arabia, Exxon, Chevron, and the Trump administration conspired to stop oil production to raise the price of gas at the pump, which means to rob and steal from retail investors. I mean, tell me what's the difference between them doing that and what these guys are doing with AMC and GME and other stocks in the stock market. The big dogs get together and they conspire to do what? To fix the price of a security in order to rob retail investors, in order to rob pension funds, in order to rob institutions that follow the rules. But they went to court and the court threw out their case. Hopefully, we will be more fortunate with our lawsuit in the securities industry. Hopefully, we will have issues that the courts determine needs to be litigated. Hopefully, we can get to discovery. Hopefully, we can get those blue sheets and that trading history of AMC and GME over the past 36 to 48 months. And if we can get our hands on that, if the judge orders discovery or if the judge orders that AMC and GME can't be traded until we get an accurate share count or the dog pools rather need to be shut down until we get an accurate share count, that would be monumental. Could you guys imagine if the judge ruled that there can be no dog pool trading of AMC and GME until an accurate share count is done. That would send the market into a frenzy. But that's what I believe we need. That's what I believe we need to get to some justice. When I read this lawsuit this morning that the courts threw out the case, it made me less optimistic okay it may be less optimistic that we can get justice inside the courtroom because these guys allegedly conspired to raise the price of gas well just to, to shut down production so the price of gas at the pumps would go up so they can make money while taking money out of our pockets hopefully the judge feels that we have issues that need litigating and we get the Ken Griffin Citadel Robin Hood FINRA lawsuit 
to the discovery phase. Hopefully we get the judge to determine that there should be no trading of AMC and GME in the dog pools until an accurate share count is done. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that us as consumers, as retail investors, as the 99%, do you think that we have any hope in the courtroom when we're fighting against the 1%? Anyway, have a great day. God bless and I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.